Can you spell your name? My name is Panos Panoyan, P-A-N-O-S, P-A-N-O-Y-A-N. P-A-N-O-S. P-A-N-O-Y-A-N. That's my last name. P-A-N-O-Y-A-N. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Panoyan? Panoyan. Panoyan. Last name again? P-A-N-O-Y-A-N. That's his last name. I think his first name. Panos. P-A-N-O-S. Thank you. Thank you. You may go to it. Thank you. Sir, are you a California registered process server? Yes, sir. What's your registration number? It's 2014133019. And you're registered in the County of Los Angeles? Yes, sir. How long have you been doing that job? It's about 16 years. at 1410 Ewing Street in Los Angeles in March of 2020. Yes, I do. And what did you go there for? Uh, I went there to uh, serve a notice. Sir, can you be sure to cover your nose with your mask? Oh. Thank you. You went there to serve a notice? Yes. Do you recall what date you did that? So March the 21st? The 21st. It's a Saturday, yes. What do you recall about that date? I went to the property, and um, I tried to, I knocked the bell, I mean, to ring the bell, and nobody answered, so I posted the notice on the door. Did you mail a copy thereafter? Yes, I did. I want you to look at the paper that's in front of you there. Does that reflect, does that reflect the document that you served, copy of the document you served? Yes. And on the next page, there's a proof of service. Is, you, is that your proof of service for that service? Should we identify for the record the documents? I'm the sorry, complaint, plaintiff's one. Yes, I served this five-day notice. You served that five-day notice? Yes, I did. And what time of day did you do that? It was in the morning time. And how do you remember it was in the morning time? It was a Saturday morning because I, I uh, cut my finger when I was posting the notice. I, I remember. Thank you. I don't have any further questions, Your Honor. Mr. Seidy Lance, you may examine the witness, sir. Can I, can I get a uh, reply to the last couple sentences? I could not hear the uh, witness. Uh, yeah, he remembers serving the five-day notice because that Saturday morning when he was serving it and posting it, he cut his finger. I remember that. Um, Is there somebody yeah. playing, Mr. Mr. Side glass, is somebody playing the guitar? I hear guitar strings. Uh, no one's playing it. It's been nearby. I've plucked twice on accident. Sorry. That's okay. When you pluck the guitar strings, I hear the, the chord, and it's more difficult to hear you speak. So if we could reposition the guitar so it doesn't get plucked while you're asking your questions, I'd appreciate it, please. I would totally work with you on that. No problem. Thank you. You may examine the witness, sir. So when, uh, okay. Uh, Mr. Panoyan, how do I pronounce your last name again? So I don't butcher it, please. Panoyan. Panoyan? Panoyan. Okay, thank you, Panoyan. Uh, do you work for Jacqueline Grace Pelez as a process server for other cases? I didn't understand your question. Do I work? Can you repeat it again? Do you work for Jacqueline Grace Pelez's law firm, Simonian Law, directly as, a, as your main business of process serving? No, I don't. I, I'm a process server. I work with a lot of different attorneys. Has Jacqueline Grace Pelez been your lawyer for process serving um, conflicts of interest in the prior case? Objection. Ask and answer. Ask and answer. Inappropriate. Uh, Sorry. Overruled by cross examination. You may answer the question, sir. When you when you pricked your finger on the gate, uh, do you do you recall uh, what you did uh, right after? What did I do right after I? Um, there, the the I door can... has uh, nails that are sticking out from the other side. So when I was posting the notice, I poked my finger. So I just I was trying to wipe it off. I mean. <laughs> 
I didn't answer the question. Next question. No problem. That's accurate. Do you, uh, do you recall that you were wearing a mask or not uh, due to the mask provisions, whether or not you were actually performing this act with a mask on? Uh, I, I wasn't wearing a mask, no. Do you recall that your um, testimony states that you served a person of uh, different height and color than 5'7 and uh, Sandy Blonde? You, you say that you served a person with 5'9 uh, or something like that, and uh, Sandy and Sandy was blonde red. Objection mistakes the evidence. Sustained. His statement. What was the, what was, I'm sorry for the little ruffling of noises over here. Um, what color do you recall the hair of the individual you delivered the service to? Objection mistakes the evidence. This is, I posted and I didn't see anybody to stay. This is over. Right down. I want you to recall what you wrote down. Did you write down that you served somebody? No. Next question, please. But that's not... Let's not, let's not argue with the witness. Let's just ask your next question, please. <laughs> oh, guys, uh, sorry to interrupt. Uh, it's Daniel Resch. I'm a witness for the body of Glenn Party. Just uh, acknowledge that I'm here on the phone line. Thank you. Please mute yourself. Let's ask your next question, Mr. Seidema. Um, how many times did you return in the same exact visit, Mr. Penyon? Uh, how, how many times? Uh, I, don't, I don't understand what he's saying. How you many times? back more than one time on March 21st? No, one time. All right. He did not drive up. Get out of your car, get back in your car, get out of your car, get back in your car, switch the papers, switch the papers again, and then leave going downhill, then turn around and go back uphill. Objection to the form of the question. That's the question. Did you do all those chaotic things I just described that were literally a circuit of driving up and down the street, parking multiple times, getting in and out of the car, parking in different places, and switching the documents three times? The court will sustain its own objection under 352. Let's start, ask your next question, Mr. Seidenglass, please. Did Mr. Canyon park his car in the middle and switch the documents? No. Did Mr. Canyon cut at our ring camera and fiddle with our mailbox? No. Did Mr. Canyon touch the mailbox in any way? No. Did Mr. Pennyon realize that a ring camera actually records? Uh, no. Okay, well... No, that's the next question. Okay, Miss Seidenglass, do you have any questions on the witness? Yes, we do. Uh, what was the document you said, um, according to your uh, declaration of service of the notice of termination uh, document? I, I didn't understand. I couldn't hear the question, Your Honor. There's an objection unintelligible. Please restate your question. Sustain. Yeah, sorry. Um, well, um, what was the document you said on March 21st? Um, what document did you serve on March 21st? I served the, the five-day notice. Okay. And, the, and how did you serve the uh, this document? How did I serve it? What? Yes, what was the mode method of serving this document? You actually have document okay. here? And the other page as well. Is this the uh, five day notice or the document attached? That's, that's the notice of the POS. That's the proof of service there. Unintelligible, Your Honor. We couldn't hear. We couldn't hear what you said. Can you please repeat your question? Are you a, are you a registered process service? Yes. And so let me. Do you see that you are familiar with process serving uh, rules? Yes. Or Hello. 
Empire. Time, yes. Not to the third time, just answer the question, sir. Please don't argue. I apologize. No, everything's very, very fine, everything's very well. Just don't argue with the person okay. asking the question. Please ask your next question, sir. Okay, um, and, uh, so, so, um, Posted the notice on the door. You posted the notice on the door? Yes. What, what door? The door, when you're going up there, there's one door. There's a door, it's an old wooden door, which that's the one way to get into the property. I do the property? I repeat. Say that again? Mr. Side and Glance, Mr. Side and Glance. It stated that there was a ring doorbell that recorded this witness doing everything on March 21. And Mr. Seidenglass asked a number of questions about the activity of this witness on that date. Yes. So, so I just wanted to remind you what the state of the evidence is. Asking him to describe the door would be appropriate if he wanted to argue that he wasn't there that day. But I heard Mr. Seidenglass testify that there was a ring doorbell recording him being there that day. So you may ask any question you'd like, I'm not cutting you off, but I wanted to remind you that your husband's already established that there was a ring doorbell recording this witness activities at that door that day, and when the witness said he had pricked his finger and was bleeding, your husband stated that he remembered that. You may ask any question you'd like, ma'am, please go on. Thank you very much. Um, I appreciate that. Uh, uh, the reason I was asking, you, don't, you don't have to take, you don't have to state the reason, just ask your next question, please. Okay, okay. Uh, did you, did, uh, did you have approval from the court uh, to file substitute service uh, as required by civil code procedure? Your Honor, that's not relevant. Excuse me, is that an objection? Objection relevance, Your Honor. What's the relevance, ma'am? Uh, well, he's, he's saying that he posted it on the door, and that isn't necessarily personal service. Are, so we, talking about, are we talking about the summons and complaint, or are we talking about the five-day notice, ma'am? Um, well, all of them, and, and in particular, this, what instance would be the five-day notice complaint, but uh, as all of them, they were all posted up. Mr. Winnipeg? Your Honor, they've entered into this lawsuit. In fact, they barged into this lawsuit originally uh, and, and were added themselves to the case. So the issue regarding service of the summons and complaint is not before the court. It is. It was an element you established. You thought to introduce by calling this witness to show that the five-day notice was served. Isn't that an element of your case? No, I'm, I'm, you, you misunderstood my statement, Your Honor. I said the issue regarding the service of the complaint, the summons and complaint. I agree. Well, right now I'm talking about the service of the five-day notice. I, I'm, just, I'm just moving my, I'm moving back to that question. Oh. As to the issue of the service of the Five day, a 15 day notice. 15. The 15 day notice can be served by posting and mailing under 1162. It doesn't require personal service. Uh, isn't this a five day notice? It's a, I'm, I'm sorry, five day notice. My, my brain switched over the other kind of case. Yes, five doesn't day notice. does not require an order to post. It does not require an order to post. That's why I said to her, there's a difference between the rules regarding the summons and complaint and the rules regarding the, the notice. Correct, 1162. The objection is sustained. It's five o'clock. The five-day notice does not have to be approved by a judge to be posted. Can I get, can I the civil code on that notice? I'm familiar. No, just ask your next question. Okay, I understand. Now, you saw a person by... I'm sorry, they ran off down the hill, but then they said they were going to come back. I can't hear you. Hello? Hello? 
slow. Okay. It's four o'clock. Can you untangle that one? Can you untangle that one? Oh, I need to move a couple branches so that thing can get by. First of all, this is an owl zone and it's freaking out the owls. Huh? That, that must fre freak out the owls. Yeah. yeah. Uh, the question's a little vague. Yes. It's over public, or it's over private property in the first place.
It's okay. How long has it been there now? I don't know. Like, at least like 10 minutes. It's okay, Trixie. Can you say hi to six? Please go. There's gonna be somebody just using it. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm thinking too, but. Yeah, but you don't know. Yeah, so, can you just say hi hovering right above where you are. Yeah, no. Yeah. Can you, can you say hi to Trix real quick? Yeah. I brought him with me. He's picked up. Hi, Trix. Hi. Hi, oh, Trix. It's okay. Like, Hello. Hi. 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 Come on, Come on. It's not that scary. I'm trying to get desensitize them to like the world. Come on. 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 